In short, the inclusion of the citizenship question on the 2020 census threatens the very foundation of our democratic system and does so based on a self-defeating rationale, U.S. District Court Judge Richard Seaborg of the Northern District of California wrote in his 126-page opinion. Seaborg is now the second federal judge to rule against the inclusion of the question on the 2020 census. U.S. District Judge Jesse Furman of the Southern District of New York issued an earlier ruling halting Commerce Secretary Wilbur Ross's plan to include the question. Attorneys for the state of California argued in court last week that including the question is this person a citizen of the United States on the census would undermine its accuracy, costing the state millions. The citizenship question will provide a differential undercount of Latinos and non-citizens, and by extension, Californians, Deputy Attorney General Matthew Wise said in court. California's budget line item for census outreach swelled from a pre-citizenship question allocation of $43.3 million to a final allocation of $90.3 million. An undercount of Latino citizens could even cost the state a seat in Congress, Wise argued. The Trump administration argues that including the question on the census will aid in enforcing the Voting Rights Act and protect minorities from discrimination. Seaborg called that rationale a sham justification and sided with the lawyers for California.